And with three weeks to go until Election Day, there is already record-breaking turnout. Nearly 12 million Americans have already cast their vote. Today, voters in Texas waited for hours in long lines on the state's first day of early in-person voting. In Harris County, which includes Houston, more than 100,000 have already voted, breaking a record for early voting two hours before polls closed. Now, this comes as a federal appeals court sides with the governor there in his bid to limit the number of those drop-off ballot boxes. We get more now from CBS's Janet Shanlian. In their red pickup, Richard and May Joyce Nickerson, both in their 70s, just drove 35 miles to vote. It really does not make sense. It's, it's totally inconvenient. But we had to do it. They used to drive a few minutes. The Nickersons live outside of Houston in Harris County, home to almost 5 million people, but just one absentee ballot drop-off location. There were 12 in this largely Democratic county, the other 11 forced to close, after Republican Governor Greg Abbott, citing election security, limited every county to a single collection site. Is there a legitimate reason to close these satellite drop-off locations? I don't see a legitimate reason. I think it's completely illogical. Harris County uh, Judge Lena Hidalgo has joined civil rights groups across Texas in calling it a blatant attempt at voter suppression. This tent, a couple hundred yards from Houston's football stadium, is now the only place to drop off a ballot in all of Harris County, a county that is one of the most populous in the nation, spanning more than 1,700 square miles and geographically larger than the state of Rhode Island. The Nickersons had time and transportation to make the trip, but worry about those who don't. The bus ain't gonna bring you here. You can't walk across this parking lot. They're not gonna let you. So you have to have some type of vehicle to get you into this location. For some, what could be a new barrier to the ballot box? Janet Shamley and CBS News, Houston.